Do you remember the first time you ever caught a glimpse of the enchanting Natalie Wood? That timeless beauty who graced both the silver screen and our hearts with her undeniable charisma. Perhaps it was during a quiet evening at home, the flickering glow of the television casting soft shadows across your living room, as you were introduced to the world of cinema through her captivating performances. Or maybe it was a chance encounter with one of her iconic films, like West Side Story or Rebel Without a Cause, where her talent shone brighter than any star in the night sky. Natalie Wood, with her bewitching eyes and undeniable talent, left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Her journey from child actress to Hollywood icon is a tale as riveting as any script, filled with unexpected twists and turns. So, as we delve into some intriguing facts about this legendary actress, let's take a moment to remember those fond memories she gifted us with and celebrate the enduring legacy of Natalie Wood. Natalie Wood, a star's journey through Hollywood's tumultuous season, the glittering constellation of Hollywood stars. Natalie Wood shone with a brilliance uniquely her own. Born Natalia Nikolaevna Zakarenko on July 20, 1938, in San Francisco, she would go on to become one of the most iconic actresses of her generation. Yet, beyond her undeniable talent and breathtaking beauty, Wood's life was a tapestry woven with complexities and hidden layers. Nate Alley's ascent to stardom began early, with her first appearance in a film at the tender age of four. A mere glimpse of her in Happy Land was enough to predict her luminous future. But beneath the charm and charisma was a life marked by adversity. Her parents, Russian immigrants, faced their share of hardships, including a language barrier, which Natalie herself would later overcome. Wood's breakthrough role came in 1955, when she portrayed Judy in Rebel Without a Cause alongside James Dean. This film catapulted her into the limelight, and her performance earned her an Academy Award nomination at just 17, making her one of the youngest nominees in history. Despite her early success, Wood's journey was not without turbulence. She was known for her vulnerability and suffered from a fear of water, stemming from a traumatic childhood incident. This phobia was significant because it played a fateful role in her life. The tragic drowning of Natalie Wood off the coast of Catalina Island in 1981 remains one of Hollywood's most haunting mysteries. Her death during the filming of Brainstorm shocked the world and has been a subject of speculation and intrigue for decades. Yet, amidst the shadows of her untimely death, Wood's career continued to soar. She received three Academy Award nominations in total, including for her roles in Splendor in the Grass and Love with the Proper Stranger. Wood's ability to convey a wide range of emotions on screen was nothing short of extraordinary, leaving an indelible mark on Hollywood's history. Beyond her acting prowess, Natalie Wood was known for her magnetic presence and her ability to light up any room she entered. She had an enduring impact on her co-stars and colleagues, who often spoke of her warmth and kindness. Her friendships with stars like Elizabeth Taylor and James Dean were well documented, showcasing her genuine and compassionate nature. Natalie Wood's life, marked by early success, personal struggles, and enigmatic tragedy, continues to captivate and mystify. Her legacy lives on in the hearts of her fans and in the timeless films that bear her unforgettable performances. Her story reminds us that even amidst the brightest stars, there can be shadows, and even in the depths of darkness, there can be moments of incandescent brilliance. In the end, Natalie Wood's life was a complex voyage through the turbulent waters of fame, fortune, and personal demons. She remains a legend in the annals of Hollywood, her star forever etched in the celestial canvas of cinema. Natalie Wood, of Russian and Ukrainian descent, had a family rooted in working-class backgrounds. Her paternal grandparents were Stefan Zakarenko and Eudoxy Sachenko, who also went by Joyce Zavarin. On her mother's side, her grandparents were Stepan Ilik Zudilov and Maria Andreevna Kilova. Natalie's father worked as a janitor and a prop builder but retired in his 30s. Her mother claimed to have been a ballerina. One noteworthy aspect of Natalie Wood's life was her deep fear of drowning. This fear stemmed from a childhood incident during the filming of The Green Promise in 1949 when she had a near-death experience. This fear persisted throughout her life and even affected her work. Director Aaliyah Kazan had to employ some creative tactics, including promising her double pay and deceiving her to get her to perform scenes involving water and splendor in the grass in 1961. Natalie Wood's personal life included a daughter, Courtney Wagner, born on March 9, 1974, 
from her marriage to Robert Wagner. Natalie Wood's journey from her humble family background to her successful Hollywood career was marked by talent and determination. Despite her lifelong fear, she left a lasting legacy in the film industry and continues to be remembered for her contributions to cinema. When Natalie Wood died in 1981, the circumstances surrounding her death remained largely unexplained, and media coverage was notably subdued. It's the tabloids that have kept the case in the news all these years. Despite her significant career in Hollywood, the details of her tragic passing have been a subject of ongoing speculation and intrigue. Natalie Wood had a humble start attending ballet classes as a child, alongside Jill St. John and Stephanie Powers. Interestingly, all three women would later have long-term relationships with Robert Wagner, adding a unique twist to their interconnected lives. Wood began smoking at the age of 16, a habit that stayed with her for many years. Her co-star from Gypsy in 1962, Morgan Brittany, once remarked, I never saw her without a cigarette, ever. However, she made the decision to quit smoking when she turned 40, demonstrating her determination to lead a healthier life. Natalie Wood's life, marked by both fame and mystery, continues to captivate the public's interest, making her a timeless figure in Hollywood history. Natalie Wood, the renowned actress, was a woman of surprising encounters and connections during her lifetime. While there isn't substantial information available on her interactions with the Harvard Lampoon, there is an intriguing story that sheds light on her unique character. On Sunday, April 23, 1966, Natalie Wood turned heads when she appeared at the Harvard Lampoon's event. This was unusual because the Lampoon had a reputation for singling her out for derision, even naming her the year's worst performer. To everyone's amazement, she accepted her citation, marking the first time a recipient of such an honor had attended the event. It was a bold move that showcased her grace and sense of humor. Additionally, Natalie Wood was a woman of linguistic versatility. She was fluent in both Russian and English, a testament to her multicultural background and international appeal. Lastly, the connection between Wood and the yacht Splendor adds another layer to her life story. The yacht shared its name with her 1961 film, Splendor in the Grass. This association demonstrates how her work in Hollywood left a lasting mark on her personal life. In summary, Natalie Wood's unexpected appearance at the Harvard Lampoon event, her proficiency in both Russian and English, and the yacht Splendor all contribute to the fascinating tapestry of her life. She was a versatile actress with a unique blend of charm and charisma. As we bid adieu to this nostalgic journey through the life and work of Natalie Wood, it's an opportunity to pause and reflect on our personal connection with this iconic actress. Her indelible mark on the world of entertainment has touched countless hearts, and now it's your turn to share your cherished memories and thoughts about her performances. Did her enchanting portrayal in West Side Story ignite a passion for musicals in your heart? Or perhaps her timeless elegance in Rebel Without a Cause left an enduring impression? Maybe it's her magnetic charisma in Splendor in the Grass that resonates with your own experiences of love and longing. Whatever your connection with Natalie Wood may be, we invite you to share it with us and your fellow enthusiasts. In doing so, you become a part of the collective tapestry of admiration for Nate Ali's artistry. Your insights and recollections enrich the appreciation for her remarkable talent and enduring legacy. As we celebrate the beauty she brought to the silver screen, let us continue to honor her memory by keeping her spirit alive through our shared experiences. Thank you for taking this journey with us and for your time and interest in paying tribute to Natalie Wood, a true luminary in the world of entertainment. Your stories and sentiments add a vibrant hue to the canvas of her life and work. Until we meet again in the world of shared passions, take a moment to reflect on the magic that was Natalie Wood and keep her memory alive in your heart.